All animals change as they grow. Now let's see an example of a dolphin. A newborn dolphin is gray in color, while a fully grown dolphin is black and white in color. Now let's see the life cycle of some animals. First of all, let's see life cycle of a butterfly. We will learn it in stages. In stage one, the butterfly lays an egg. In stage two, the egg hatches into a caterpillar. In the next stage, the small caterpillar eats a lot of leaves and grows into a big caterpillar. The size of a caterpillar increases a lot. This is the third stage of a butterfly's life cycle. Now comes the fourth stage. In the fourth stage, the caterpillar attaches itself to a twig and forms a hard outer shell all around itself. And this is then called a pupa. Inside this pupa, the caterpillar changes into a butterfly. This hard outer shell camouflages itself from the predators. Now after spending a lot of time in this cocoon, the pupa has changed into a fully grown butterfly. And then it emerges out of the cocoon, a fully grown butterfly appears. And the life cycle starts all over again as a butterfly gives eggs again. Now let's revise the cycle. Stage number one, the butterfly lays an egg. Stage number two, the egg hatches into a caterpillar, which is small in size. Stage number three, the small caterpillar has eaten a lot of leaves and has grown into a bigger caterpillar. Stage number four, the caterpillar attaches itself to a twig and builds a hard shell around itself. And at this stage, it is called a pupa. Stage number five. After spending a lot of time in this cocoon, the pupa changes into a fully grown butterfly, which starts to come out of its cocoon. Stage number six. A beautiful butterfly appears. So kids, we learned life cycles of a butterfly. Now we will learn the life cycle of a frog. Let's start. First of all, a female frog lays the eggs. Now stage number two, after about 20 or 21 days, the eggs changes into tadpoles that more or less look like a small fish. And then after about five weeks, the tadpole starts growing legs, lungs, and can swim. Gradually, this frog then changes into a small frog with a small tail. And this froglet keeps on changing into a fully grown frog. And the tail starts vanishing. And at the end, there is no tail with the frog. So kids, today we learn about many animals and their young ones, and also the growth changes of many animals, like the butterfly and the frog. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and share this video. And if you want to see more fun videos, you can hit that subscribe button. You can also follow us on Facebook and Instagram for more content. Bye-bye!